Oh, uh, yo, gosh, we're already losing tons of money. Let's keep on going. Oh, uh, yo, good idea, Goofy. <laughs> so, I couldn't believe this when I opened my eyes. Mm, just looking at my phone in bed, and I was like, you have got to be kidding me. <laughs> so, this is, uh, this is supposed to be a rumor. However, the title of this article does not say that it's a rumor. I saw different articles, and I just basically clicked on the first one. And, um... This has got to be another stupid Disney decision. You see, I'm going to talk about why I think they think they can get away with this, if this rumor is true. The only reason why they think they can get away with this at this point is because The Rock played Hercules, right? But The Rock, unlike Michael B. Jordan and myself, because Michael B. Jordan looks like my damn cousin, he is racially ambiguous. See, uh, I was looking at something a little while ago. It was an article. It was talking about the success of Vin Diesel and The Rock. And it was talking about part of the reason why they were very successful is because they could be sold to different races. They can be shopped to different races. They're racially ambiguous so a lot of different races races and ethnicities can see themselves in them. And people subconsciously do like to see someone that looks like themselves on the big screen and when they're being sold to. But it doesn't work all the time as you've been noticing, Disney. Okay? I've seen dark-skinned Greeks. Okay? They don't look like Michael B. Jordan. Not the ones that I've seen. Maybe there are some Greeks that look exactly like me. And then, hey, I stand corrected and I apologize. However, okay, I have seen dark-skinned Greeks that look like The Rock. I have seen them, okay? I think Michael B. Jordan is a smarter actor than this. So there's got to be something else at play that would... Make him even want to, make him even do this. Doesn't make sense whatsoever. Um, and um, I guess Disney, you know what you should change yourself, your name to? Just cross out Disney, keep the same font, and change your name to Backlash. Okay? Backlash Studios. Because it's going to be coming again, and I'm not going to be one of them. I'm just going to be the one watching you. Like, see, I told you. I told you. That's going to be me. Okay? You are already messing up phenomenally. Phenomenally. I am a fan. I've been a fan for years of your movies and entertainment. And you continue to not be faithful to these characters. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. And I'm a Michael B. Jordan fan. Why don't you, hey, here's an idea. Why don't you create a new IP based on an African god or superhero? How about that? And you cast Michael B. Jordan. Just a thought. So it says here, Disney looks set to cast Michael B. Jordan as lead in live action Hercules. As the masses await Snow White. <laughs> no, we are not awaiting Snow White. <laughs> but, but you ready for a bunch of reshoots? <laughs> the next entry in Disney's live action universe. <laughs> Many are also looking ahead at what is to come from the House of Mouse. <laughs> and the live action Hercules movie will reportedly feature... Marvel star Michael B. Jordan. Over the last few years, Walt Disney Company's efforts to retell their own classic animated stories in live action format have 
received mixed reviews. No, it's not mixed. <laughs> there are those fans who love seeing their favorite characters come to life in a whole new way. But there are also those who would prefer one of the most prominent entertainment powerhouses in the history to put the original stories over retellings. To put out their original. So sorry, I, I literally, I did just wake up and I was just like, okay, start doing videos. Uh, but the live action machine is not slowing down <laughs> next year. We will see the release of the much discussed Snow White. Yeah, but now, and that's been pushed back. So, yes, and it's been surrounded by controversy. Looking past Snow White, many more films are scheduled to join the catalog of movies that are already include that already includes Alice in Wonderland, Beauty and the Beast, Aladdin, Lion King, and The Little Mermaid. Mufasa, The Lion King 2024, Moana 2025, Hercules to be determined, uh, Lilo and Stitch to be determined, and Bambi to be determined. You know, I had uh, somebody stupid put in the comments, Bambi was a female deer. If it wasn't, he would have had horns if you. <laughs> Apparently this person didn't see the, didn't see the movie for, for, um, Bambi. Didn't see the original and, and they don't know how deers develop. Oh, Lord. We know, uh, for example, that Dwayne, the Rock Johnson, uh, will co-produce Moana. And that the former professional wrestler will reprise his role as Maui. We also know that Bambi will reportedly adapt the scene featuring the death of Bambi's mother. I mean, here's my thing with Bambi's mom dying. I mean, you don't have to... I think in the original, wasn't there just kind of like a gunshot in the distance? Or something like that, you know? It's not like he saw her dead body or... Like, what you call it was worse. Like, something like... Uh, uh, what's it called? Ah, uh, the uh, land before time. Is that it? Land before time. When Little Fitz's mom died, I mean, she was fighting that Tyrannosaurus off, and she died in front of him, telling him where to go and what to do. That was sad. That was really sad. And I mean, yes, the Bambi mom's death is sad, also. So I mean. The fact that the matter is she was shot by a hunter. So I, I don't know exactly how they're going to do it. But I think what people are more concerned about is if you're going to change something about Bambi himself. Himself. So, uh, we'll see. Speaking of Hercules at present, all that is known is that Guy Ritchie is directing, following his work on the billion dollar Aladdin. And Anthony and Joe Russo are producing... With the, okay, well, I mean, we'll see. But the fact of the matter is, don't choose Michael B. Jordan. And Michael B. Jordan, you know it ain't the best decision. You already know. Like, don't even, come on now. You, come on now. Mm -mm -mm. Ridiculous. I want you to post comments down below. Let me know what you think about the situation. If you enjoyed my thoughts and take on this, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and share.